My name is John Kettle. I'm a partner in the independent law firm McCullough Robertson. I run the international practice and we're a law firm of about 200 lawyers and we're the biggest firm in the country which isn't headquartered in Sydney or Melbourne. Well, I run the international practice here at McCullough's. So that means I, you know, traditionally, I would have traveled a lot. I also have a big corporate and competition law practice, and I specialize in cross-border um, activity into Australia from, from outside. And because I worked in Europe, and particularly Ireland and the UK for 20 years, I understand the demands of cross-border business and the cultural differences of doing business in Australia as opposed to doing business, say, in Europe. I joined the Chamber because it's a participate in those industry sectors we specialize in as a firm, the likes of energy, uh, infrastructure, um, projects, and so on, with some digi business as well. But it was really those infrastructure, construction, uh, energy aspects of things which made it attractive. In addition to being able to have speaking slots and, and running events, which we, we quite enjoy here in McCullough's, it does have the cachet to be able to bring together a room of top industry professionals in a given sector. So defense is very important to us. So a couple of years ago, for instance, we were able to get together all the top industry people in the defense sector in Queensland together in a room and have a really positive conversation. And that led to you know, other things and leads and relationships which have been pretty positive. If one is a member, that you, you won't get that benefit by being passive. One must be proactive in seeking opportunities out as well as being a mere member. So, and, and you get some pretty good seminars, but you know, by and large, it's, it's, a, pretty pro, it's a pretty dynamic and active organization. And certainly the most active of all, you know, maybe it's in the top two chambers that are most active in the Queensland market. Uh, and from what I see online and so on, almost nationally too. One doesn't participate in chambers unless one is seeking to ultimately secure clients, right? If you can't monetize a relationship out of it, it's not the maximum return that you're getting. So we've been fortunate, we've been able to secure some good relationships in terms of both leads, as I mentioned, but which have crystallized into actual business, right? So dollars. come along to one of the seminars, uh, which are always pretty good. The speakers are always excellent, right, in my experience. And you always get very good insider industry knowledge. And the other thing to bear in mind is you don't need to speak French. I could, but you just laugh, so I don't.